Who's looking forward to today? Me! I want you to go out, have fun, play hard, tackle hard, and support each other. Like the coach said, tackle hard, use your shoulders, George. Tackle, tackle, tackle! Oh, why won't they tackle? Get stuck in! Go, Levi! That's the way, Magpies! Offside, open your other eye, Red! Penalty blue, white player. How can he roll away when people won't get off him? you? Hey, mate! Calm down, eh? It's only a game. What is up and welcome to Small Blacks TV. This week we have Blackburn 7 star Ruby Tui with us. How's it going? Welcome to Small Blacks TV. Thanks for having me. Now Ruby, you're awesome on the rugby field but you're also awesome in front of the camera. Tell us about that. Yeah, well, love rugby, you know, so um, when I can, I get the chance, I go out and do some commentating, you know, a little bit. I love playing rugby, I love training rugby, and I love talking about it, so it's perfect. Same as me, so you must watch me and be like, how does he do it? He's so amazing. So Come if you on. need tips, you can holler at me. I'm pretty busy now, because, you know, I've got my mate Scurry, mm. Scuds, I call them more nicknames with yeah. the boys. But I've seen you're busy. Yeah, so, but I'm, hey, I can, what's your nickname? Rubes. Rubes, well, Rubes, I can help you out if you need some tips. Oh, thanks. Appreciate but if it. I need rugby tips, do you know where I go? Where do you go? Kicking Masterclass. Oh. Hey, I'm Bowden Barrett, All Blacks first five and kicker. Hi, I'm Kendra Cockchidge, Blackburn's halfback and kicker. We've assembled some of the best small blacks kickers in town. And it's time for today's Kicking Masterclass. Today's skill is the chip kick. I know Bodie loves these types of kicks. Bodie, when you chip kick it, how do you get the ball to bounce back into your hand? Uh, some of it's luck. Ideally, you want to give yourself a 50-50 chance by getting that perfect flight, so it's either going to go forward or backwards. The rest of it's luck, but we can control a lot of it. Has anyone here got any key points on the chip kick? A short follow through. Perfect, so we want a short follow through, okay? So we kick it nice and short, and then so we're ready to run and try and catch the ball after we've kicked it over a player. Raise your toe. Yeah, so we want to raise our toe, okay, so that our toes are pointing to the sky, so we get that back spin and the ball's nicely floating through in the air. Hopefully get a good bounce as well. Okay, guys, here we go. All in, all in. Nice and tight. All right, guys, let's give 110% out there. We train like we play, okay, boys? So let's go kick it on three. One, two, three. Kick it! All we're going to do today is the chip kick. Okay, how many of you have seen Bodie do a chip kick and score? Lots of times, eh? All right, so we want to make sure that our, our body, okay, our head is over the ball, okay, our ball's nice and upright like this. When we drop it, we just want a short little wee follow through there, okay, and we want our toes pointing to the sky. All right, should we see if Bodie can do it? Okay. There you go, mate. My name is Josh Kennedy. 12 years old and I play half-back for Avalon. I love rugby because I like scoring tries. Nice. Okay. Good ball. Chip kick. Nice. nice. You chip over good. me. Kick him in. Nice. Oh, just Not about. Bad. Oh. A little, little bit more height. That's good. There Pretty we go. Pretty good. Nice. Oh, it's a good one. Can you get there? The bounce. Oh. oh. Yeah, very good. good. How many can you do press-ups? Two hands on the ball, like this, chest to ball, straight arms. 15 seconds. Three, two, one, go. Straight arms, chest to ball. That's it. Oh, it's hard work, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> two, one, that's it. Right, how many? Seven. Ten. All right, there's a lot of technicalities. Not the perfect technique, but anyway, challenge is on you. 
So we've seen the small blacks go pretty well. We're going to see how Noah can go. I got Ready? it. Ready? Yep. I got it. Three. Two, wait, 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 wait. What's the record? How many I got to do? Um, just do your best, Noah. Noah. I'm ready. I was born ready. Three, two, one, go. Uh, you got this, Noah. You can do it. Whoa. I'm leaving. You got this. Are you sure those small you blacks win? You got this. Sure got? Just under seven seconds to go. You got this. Uh, Keep it up. Five. Uh, I know you can get one. Uh, Three, two, one. Uh, holy, holy. I think those kids had like 20 wheat picks or something before they did that. Jeepers. That was pretty hard, I don't think. They must have had special effects on that. Do you reckon maybe I could have a go? Just see. You could try, but that was pretty hard. I wouldn't even time you, because probably, yeah. Give it a crack, eh? You can do it on your knees if you want. Oh, yeah, is it? Yeah. What the? So I've started this year, this is my first year playing, and it was through my school and through Chalk and Arms, our coaches. They've started um, women's rugby in Gisborne and it's just grown this whole year since then. I just gave sevens a go this year and I just fell in love with it. So I've played football and ultimate frisbee and kiorahi this year and yeah it's all been like cross training really for rugby and it's um, really helped me out in the game. I've leaned more towards rugby now but I was a real, I just grew up in a football family. A lot of my football friends don't really agree with it and don't know why I changed over the codes but um, everyone back home is real supportive of whatever I do so it's real cool to have like been able to have options and yeah but it's cool. It's only my first year still, so I've obviously got way more to experience, but um, just the opportunities that Gisborne, Gisborne women are getting now, and like being able to play from home, it's real, yeah, it's real good, and I want to go far. Um, I think vision, definitely vision, knowing, uh, playing with my head up, and um, being able to tell what the opposition's doing on defense or um, attack, and yeah, that's probably one of my strengths out there. I love rugby because it's a real um, inspiring team game and like you just become one family out on that field and you've got each other's backs all day and that's, it's just like a second family and it's just, yeah, I love the game. I'm Renee Holmes and I'm all in. Okay, 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 oh, hey, welcome back to the show, oh, Ruby. Oh, just sorry. showing off now. It was first to 300, sorry. Jeepers. Any, anyway, our guest today, Black Fern 7 star, aka Miss Show Off, I've got <laughs> too much press ups in me, Ruby Tui. Ruby, do you do a lot of texting? Yeah, I text my family, mum, my sister. Would you ever text on your phone during training while coach is talking? I probably wouldn't even put it in my training bag, to be honest. I've got to focus on my training when I'm there. You know, that kind of focus is what my mate Lil Noah needs to learn. Coming up right now on St. McCaw's Primary. This is St. McCaw's Primary, a place where young minds are filled to overflowing with the fountain of knowledge. A sacred place to share ideas and pontificate on the wonders of the world. At least, that's what most of us are doing. Back off me after school today at detention. Shucks. Okay, Noah, well, phones and tablets are good in the right hands, but not in class. 
What do you mean? Well, there's lots of great websites with skills and drills for small blacks. Smallblacks.com is a great one. Now take a look at this one, for example. Our shoulders are over the ball. We just want to have nice, light feet. If just control the ball like that, going through. Sweet. So you want to chuck the ball down and we'll have a... We'll oh, shucks, that looks cool. I might give that a jam. <laughs> hey! Bernard Barrett! Check it out, Mr. Sneed. So, Noah, have you learned your lesson? Yeah, if I'm going to play with my phone in class, make sure it's on silent. At least you learned something. Yes, I remember the school days full of learning, laughter, and rugby. Some people think texting about having fun is more fun than the real thing. Well, let me tell you, my small black friends, it isn't. Hey guys, I'm with my good mate Rugger. Woo! And welcome to Numbers with Dane. Dane, do you know what the number of the day is? No, I don't, Rugger. I'll give you a clue. Boo! Wow. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah! So you can count. What job does number seven do in the team? He's the uh, the flanker. He's pretty important in our team. OK. Makes a lot of tackles. How about you? Do you make a lot of tackles? Uh, sometimes. Not really, though. I, usually the seven will, uh, will help me out there. You probably know this, but if you score a try and then convert mm. it, it adds up to seven. It does, Rugger. You're a smart man. Smart and good-looking. Well, what if I scored seven converted tries with seven penalties and seven drop goals? 91. That's right. Oh. And so quick. Smarter. Oh. <laughs> Did you know, Dane, there's seven days of the week? There are, Roger. Well, what's your favourite day? My favourite day is Saturday. Saturday? How come? Because it's the weekend, Rugger. Ah, so what do you do on the weekend that's so important? Well, some days I get to play rugby. Awesome! But some days I get to relax and spend time with my family. That's nice. Well, I'll see you back in another seven days. That was the number seven. Ruby, if you can guess the number that's inside my head that no one else can see, I'll give you the goodies inside this Rugger Pack. OK. I play the best game in the world, so it has to be number seven. Lucky guess, I guess. How'd you know? Lost my favourite number, play the game, seven. So. OK, well, we'll give you a pick. Can I have We'll go halves. Thanks, can I just... Thanks, Noah. All righty. Well, guys, if you text this week's number and we draw it out, you could win a rugger pick. So text in the number to 4888 and be in to win. But kids, remember to ask your parents first. Hey guys, Nikki here with a few of my friends. Jane Lee. Brooke Clan. Tito. Regan. Smeezy. Each week, we're going to add something to Tani that he'll need to play the game. And we're going to learn some te reo along the way. OK, so we all cut it out with our taro puto, poraka, tokina, Putu on our YY feet, looking flash, but there's one really important thing missing before we can think about playing. We need Oku Hoa. Anyone? Friends. Friends. Boom. Get my mates in there. Flash looking bunch, eh? Shoe fellas. <laughs> yeah, who, who's some of your friends you, you play with and play rugby with? Mary and Amy. My best friend. Timoyo. Timoyo. My friend Finn. Finn. Um, Tito. My friend Richie McCall. <laughs> <laughs> How many mates or friends or whore do we need uh, to play rugby with? Oh, to come up. Yeah, spot on. Great to have 14 and you can have 15 on 15, but you only need one other mate. You can just have one on one, one on one battles. Yeah, so one on ones. Try and smoke him, run it up the guts, or run it up the... Puku. Puku. Stomach, guts, perfect. Puku OK, kids, so our next word. Some people don't like it, but I do. It's rutu. Who knows what rutu means? Tackle. 
That's right, rutu means tackling. And why is tackling and being out of rutu important? So that you can stop the other team from getting a try. Spot on, bro. I'll give you guys a few tips that you guys can use to practice and go and use in your guys' games. There are three tips that we're going to use for the rutu or the tackle is to get in nice and close. That's the first one. Get a foot nice and close into the attacker. Um, keeping our eyes and our head up, looking at around at the hip area, that's where we want to tackle. And when we tackle, we want to keep moving forward. And forward and forward and forward and forward and all the way back to the try line. Easy, eh? What'd you have for breakfast, bro? Like 10 wee books? Ah, oh, heavy. So in nice and close, keeping our eyes and our head up. Yep. We want to target around the hips, where our arms are. Yep. And then drive forward with our legs. Oh, great leg drive, that one. All right, Riggs, have a go, bro. So you want to get in nice and close. Yep, eyes up, keep your eyes up. Yep, and then we're moving after the tackle that way. Oh, that's a good boy. And nice and close, eyes and head up. Yep, wrap our arms and then drive forward. Nice, perfect. And that's our rutu, tackle. Guys, if you want to win this ball to practice your own kicks, text kick to 4 triple A. You'll go into the draw to win this ball signed by us. The winner will be announced on smallblacks.com. Good luck. My name is Nehe. At night when the darkness comes and the demons of self-doubt visit, tell them to pass on by. This is your time and your dream, and dreams do come true. I tell myself, I'm going to beat him. I'm better than he is. I'm faster, I'm stronger, and I'm well prepared. Hey, so Ruby, that was the two-step from Nehe, but the two-step's also a dance, and I hear the Black Fern Sevens pretty mean on the old dance floor. Yeah, we try, we try. We love music, love singing, laughing and dancing. Who's the best dancer in the team? Well, depends who you ask. Um, if you ask the rest of the team, they wouldn't say me, but if you ask me, I'd say me. Well, I'm pretty mean as well, but everyone else would say I'm not. So, hey, man, you could be a pretty good dancer. Do you want to show me some moves and I'll show you some of mine? Yeah, something basic, maybe. Just got to add in the click for the next level, but we'll just start with a little two-step. Yeah. Just leaning side to side, it's pretty easy for everyone to get into. Do you do the head rock too? Yeah, head rock, and then, you know, on the kind of forward, we could um, finish on a point and a wing. Point and a wing? Yeah, so Ooh. one, two, three, and four. Boom! My yeah, wink so. didn't quite wink. <laughs> <laughs> OK, team. Saturday wasn't that bad, right? We got within 50. That's a good thing, right? Yeah! yeah. 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 No! It's not? No, Simon! It's terrible! You're a horrible team! You played like a bunch of girls! You played like a bunch of girls! Played like a bunch of girls? That's awesome. I'd love to see this. Remember to stretch before every exercise. One time it was a real emergency and I didn't have time to warm up and I pulled a wing muscle. Hi guys. Why do we look so sad? Coach said we play like girls. And? He meant we were useless. Oh, I, I, I didn't actually, uh, you... OK, for one, girls play awesome. Two, we never say negative things. Rugby is about having fun, so we always say nice things. Interesting approach, Wonder Woodman. So if I say good things, the team plays good. Exactly. Why don't we give it a go? Awesome running, Jeffrey. Good, good running, Jeffrey. Tackle, tackle, tackle. Um, good tackling, everybody.
everybody. It's good for the team. Much better, coach. It looks like my work here is done. Wonder Woman boogie. Was everyone the same size as you? Uh, I was a little bit uh, bigger back then, and I come from a small town, so yeah, I was probably the, probably the biggest kid uh, going around, so yeah, that's why I got chucked straight in the front row. So yeah, we had a lot of mates that were pretty skinny and made good locks, like uh, Brady Vitello. You just could probably tell I'm a bit taller than the average, and um, it's always been that way. Most of my teammates were actually quite bigger than me. Um, I played in the open grade. Um, when I was little, so I was very small, um, but I was never scared to take them on. Even when I was younger, I was a bit bigger than most, but I wasn't a giant or anything. What were you like as a small black? Um, when I was a small black, I was probably a sporty kid. Um, I grew up in a small country town, of about a thousand people, so um, that's what we all we really did was play sport, whether it was summer, uh, summer sports, or in the winter we'd play rugby, obviously. Um, so I'd probably say a sporty one. I'd say as an angel, perfect kid really. Um, my best friends used to get um, their parents up at the school quite a few times. My mum never visited um, a single time, I think. Uh, <laughs> probably a little bit naughty, very sporty though. I was into a bit of everything. Played basketball, rugby, rugby league. Um, did a bit of wrestling in that as well. No, it was pretty good, I reckon. Um, parents might say something different, but um, no, pretty active, really good student at school, which was, was a good thing. They're yeah, always on my best behaviour, I, I reckon. Hey, Noah, what's wrong? Well, I'm a bit sad, Ruby. It's the end of the show and you've been awesome. Yeah, but can't you watch it online? You are right, Ruby. We can, I can watch it right here. But hey, thank you for coming on the show this week. We'll see you all next week. And until then, Ruby, what do we do? We stay, stay on side, New Zealand. Drop the beat. Fist pump. Boom. See, I just keep it simple with the fist pump. One hand like that. I can do double. And then I do the old boom. <laughs> just add a dab into it. Boom. Dab. Go back. And it's my favourite. Mm. And hot. Nice work, Tommy.